Hey everyone, it's Rob Litton here from drumsaword.com, bringing you another full video song lesson for my online subscribers. Today I want to show you how to play the song Just Like Heaven by The Cure, drums by Boris Williams. The tempo is 150, 152 BPM, so quite a fast song this. The lesson really is aimed at the intermediate drummer because of that tempo. Your right hand is playing hi -hat, uh, a hi-hat pattern this tempo for three and a half minutes. So if you're a new drummer and you haven't developed the ability to play with just the wrist and keep the stick loose, the grip loose, then you're probably going to find this really, really tricky. But if you're new to the kit and you're, you are able to keep up that tempo and you don't find it too hard for you, then this lesson is also for you. I think it's also good for beginners. There are um, um, nothing going on, there's nothing going on here that's too complicated. It's just the tempo that pushes it towards the intermediate level, in my opinion. So it starts with this drum fill that gets repeated throughout the song. Um, and it occurs on the and of beat four. One and two and three and four and a one and. Right, left, right, right. This is the sticking I suggest you use. And a one and. So one and two and three and four and a one and. You can see it, it occurs there on the and of beat four. That's how the song starts. You don't get a count in um, the beginning of the song. You, it, the song just comes in on the recording. If you understand that that's and a one and and snare and crash on beat two there, that's beat two, and then you come down to the hi-hat, which we'll get onto in a second, for beat three. But before we do that, I just want to talk about some variations of this drum fill. At the beginning of the song, he definitely plays it on one drum. Like that. Later in the song, he simply moves the hands between two different toms, low and high tom in this case. But exactly the same rhythm, exactly the same pattern, just itself on one drum, just split between two drums. Right, left, right, right, crash. Now later, um, um, when they were performing live, um, they, they went through several drummers, I believe. Um, uh, uh, and later drummers played a variation of the drum fill that I would naturally play as well. Instead of playing, uh, we keep it on one drum for now, no, we'll, we'll split it up. Instead of playing the two rights on the floor tom, what drummers do and what I naturally want to do as well is just play and a one and then replace the last right hand with the bass drum. It just means you don't have to rush to the snare and to the crash too quickly with your right hand. Not that it's too much of a problem. The tempo isn't, oh, you're playing that with the right hand. So going from here to here, it's the same as just playing that all the way through anyway. So if you can do this, you can do that. But it just, it's just one of these little tricks that the more intermediate drummer learns eventually to use the bass drum to come in on the last note before you get a, uh, a, a double hand pattern somewhere. Use your snare and crash. So again, this is how I would play it. And again, later drummers, drummers later on played it live as well. But on the recording and for the beginning of the song, he just plays 